have an artist in the building. He is a Kenyan bongo flavor recording and performing artist. He's also a dancer and a businessman. And of course, he goes by the name. Of course, I'm sharing squad. I'm happy. I'm quite tired. All right, so in one, two, three, I'll let you know. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for one, Mr. Mtala. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. Look who we lay in a fire, my weza. Nashkuru. Mhm. Nashkuru. So we have to allow first to nezo ngi after show. Strong guy. You may attend. You may attend. You may attend. Not disturb me. How you doing? I'm good. Ah, so do we call you Hazina or do we call you Mtala? Any can do. <laughs> Any can do. Yote ni yangu. Yote ni zangu. Yote ni zangu. Ah, nice. Alafu, so maybe before we get started, mm -hmm. we'll prepare intro. Lakini mimi nitaka tu watu waje introduce tena just uh, kama kuna kitu ni mata inza you talk to your guys at home. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is Azina Mtaalam. Um a musician, a bongo artist from Kenya. I'm um, recording and a dancer and also a businessman. Yeah. Yeah. A businessman. Utunauza nini? Kladi. Ah, no wonder I look like me. Was it you know? All right, so let's talk music. How far along did we get started? Where, for how long have you been doing this? Did you always do it since you're in school, or is it just um, something you developed passion for later in life? Um, uh, I started doing music when I was still school. Mm. I was in primary school. Na pale ndo nili nili bundua kipaji na nika nika mo kukichimbia na kukikuza mm -hmm. mm. after 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 pale after nikiwa bado nikiwa bado primary tulikuwa right. na toshushi kidogo kidogo hivi kwa sababu sikuwa nimejua bado nataka kufanya jinra gani yeah. you know like you just like you love music but yes. you don't know what you don't know where you, where, where you are yes, exactly. so kidogo being raised in a in a in a, in a christian family i was nilikuwa nime kaubo kutosikiza mziki nyingine as in nilikuwa nimeambiwa bongo is the it's at least the clean song hapo ndo kina revani walikuwa wanaanza kina demo yeah. alikuwa yeah. ame establish yeah. wasafi so at least they were producing some good music and clean music yeah. so to kwa familia ikaonekana ah hiyo ndo mziki mzuri angalau unaweza sikiza kijana anaweza sikiza mtoto mdogo anaweza sikiza pia so growing up kusikiza bongo kusikiza bongo nikaingia high school so hapo ndo i think i captured the art ya bongo and nika more like why can't i just venture into it and just realize myself into it right. nione at least where penye inaweza niweka exactly yeah right so does that mean when you started singing your parents had a problem with that sababu first of all just listening to music was a problem yeah. lakini wakakubali bongo sasa wewe uko kuzuka kuambia sasa unajua itakuwaje mimi pia nataka mimi nataka kukuwa msanii how how did they take it um it wasn't really positive yeah at first I was positive but you know if if you really want something you just have to go hard on it kabisa lazima uiskume lazima you uoneshe like the 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 potential in you uoneshe the the tunasema nini the courage in you when you unaweza ifanya when you unaweza deliver unapata so pole pole hivyo tu na wakaamua ku buy the idea and yeah and that's how it came Right. So, mm -hmm. so far, what do you love most about being an artist? <laughs> what are you enjoying so far? And you're talking about bro, me, Mr. Ni. I know you own it. Okay, you introduce me. I'm say like I'm not just an actor. Mm -hmm. I'm not just an entrepreneur. Me, me, Mr. Ni. Mr. Ni. When I was saying, though, number one, what do you love most about it? About Mr. Ni, can you not I get to speak out my mind. Yeah. through music. Right. That's the most important thing. Without anyone having to judge you. No one. Okay. I right. just speak out as in Kenya Kokoro, what I feel, what I relate with is what I speak out in my music. Right. Mm. And what's the worst part about it? The worst part about <laughs> it. Wow. I really don't know. Mm, distribution. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, distribution most probably. Yeah. Mm. That's the most that's the most challenging thing. And it, marketing probably? Yeah. yeah. Distributing and marketing. Distributing and marketing. Yeah. yeah. Oh, all right. But we're glad that you actually have passion for it. You love what you're doing. That's mm. the most important part. And uh, <coughs> your song, your, your latest release, um, Maua, you released it featuring Ayana. Ayana and you saw that there was another version with Tess. No, it's just the same. Uh -huh. Ayana, Ayana mm. is a group of Makini and Tess. Yeah. Yeah. So they, they, formed, I had, they, they formed the group after the song was released. Mm -hmm. So wakaamua kujiunda na kujibrand pia nao wakaamua kutafuta muziki kivyao. Oh. Uh, 
That's it, because I saw there was like two versions and I was like, hmm. No, that's, okay. it's just, it's just so the, that's the, like the, the audio, audio yeah, and, and the, the video. No, yeah. no, that makes sense. Mm. And of course, we see uh, Watalam. Watalam EP, I'm going to Watalam EP. When is that dropping? Watalam EP is coming this month. This month? This month. Did you guys hear that? This month. Watalam EP is coming this month, so tune in and let's subscribe. Let's, yeah. All right, so how many tracks, who have you worked with, or who have you featured in this song in terms of collaborations and stuff? Apparently, did you feature anyone? Yeah. It's just, uh, it's just my own project. Project yangu peke yangu, kwa sababu nataka pia Kenya ipate kunisikia, ipate kujua like vibe ya ukijana ni nini. Vibe hazina mtalam ni nini. Right. Ukisikia watala, unamsikia, unapata vibe gani kuwake. Shani leo. Bas, do hivyo, hakuna, hakuna msani ambaye ni memshirikisha. Asina. Ah, nice. Mm. Uh, you know, you know, you a whole, a whole EP by yourself. Oh, you didn't tell us how many tracks? Five, ten? Four tracks. Four tracks. Four tracks. That's how, that's where you start. Like, uh -huh. just four tracks to, so that we get to know you. And just, sometimes you, you, as an artist, you sound like major, you sound like major. Yeah, like, uh, yeah. Sure. So I think like when you work on a project like that by yourself, it also helps you to know your sound, yeah. what you sound like, so that people can vibe with you just uh, that way. And um, Kenyan music, obviously, it's not it's not easy. <laughs> wow. Breaking into this market. So what keeps you motivated, knowing that Kuna Watuari and Zakwimba in the 2000s, now I did say you're about to break through. Kituchika muimu ni dua. Kimweka mungu mbele na unaika imani yako mbele na unafanya kazi yako na jituma, mungu watafungua milango mingine. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Fika. So long as you're persistent and so long as you make a do and belly, Sikuyako in Africa, Nina Funguka. All right. Mm. And you spoke about bongo music. So, are uh, like Ray Vani and uh, Diamond, those are some of the people that influenced Yeah, you sure, Kabisa. Okay. Mm. Actually, when I was growing up, I used to listen to them sana sana. Mm -hmm. Actually, Ray Amonize was my favorite. Oh, nice. Yeah, so. And what changed? You, you still, we must was. Okay, is. <laughs> still is. Yeah, is. Are you looking forward to maybe uh, doing something? Doing something, yeah. Type an opportunity Most probably. Ikikubali. Ikikuja. Ikikuja. Tunakubali. Ivo. Tunafanya kazi. Uh-huh. Eh. Na Kenya, when I do, I say, like, there's a saying about do nani kwa or sifiwi something like that. But nani ambaye unamred sana in the when it comes to like uh, music, the music industry in Kenya. Who who are you feeling? Who who do you vibe to mostly? Who do you listen to in Kenya? In Kenya, I listen to Masauti sana. Masauti, yeah. Yeah, Masauti is my favorite artist. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I thought you'd say Otile Brown. Um, Otile, <laughs> Otile, is a giant. Otile is a Kenyan giant. Let me say that. Right. Yeah, I just love his his music is just unique. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, but for me, uh, I think I vibe with Nani sana. Masauti. Una vibe na Masauti, Masauti sana sana. sana. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're looking forward to that. I know Najwa Lazima project is a jipa where na masauti and Najwa Itaweza. So, you know, and what we're going to say Kenyan industry, we only say bad things about the industry. Oh, siti kuko hivi, kuko hivi, oh, what do you love most about the Kenyan music industry? Um, There are so many upcoming artists ama wale wanyo na chipuka wacha ni tumia ujina ni tumia upcoming uwe ni fresh upcoming ni fresh hapuna mtu ambaya na pena kuitu upcoming spin upcoming kabisa so wale wanao chipuka kuna wasani wa zuri sana kuna wasani wa zuri sana ambao pia au ndo na wasikiza kwa sana wale wasani ambao wako chini kusipabu wasani wa kubwa sa hizi wanajaribu kudaivasa wanajaribu kufanya vitu vingine vipia vipia lakini wasani wa kenya wa chini ndo na wasikiza kwa sana Na tuseme kuna wasani wazuri Kenya, mm -hmm. kuna wasani wazuri Kenya chini. Mm. So that's what you love about Kenya? That's, that's uh, okay. Now that's, different sounds, maybe, like, we have different genres. Uh-huh. Kama, ya, gengeton. Gengeton wuzi pata kuingine. Gengeton ni yetu. That's our own. That's our own. Yeah. I love gengeton. Mm -hmm. I listen to, who is this guy? Brida. Oh, know, Brida. Know, and speaking of Brida, today is his birthday. Is it today or yesterday? I think today. today. Should be t yeah, today. today. Today is Brida's birthday. Today. And uh, one on the street, I don't know if it's true, but they say he's turning 24 years today. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you want to wish him a happy birthday? Yeah. <laughs> Bazenga Daddy. Uh -huh. Happy birthday, Mku. Mm -hmm. To tomorrow wins. To Nokpenda. Shout out to you, Manze. All right. Mm. All right. So you, we want you to perform for us, Maua. But before you do that, maybe you can shout out Ayana and give us the whole experience working with her. How was it? Ayana, actually, it's a group. It's a group of two. Oh, Ayana and Tess. Yeah. There, there is no. There is Makini and Tess who form oh, Ayana. Oh. Yeah. So. Oh. Okay. No. They are amazing people. Mm -hmm. They are. They are amazing people. They are. You know, so when you are 
the mind of creativity as in on the one to diverse unataka kujua nini nyingine kitu naweza toa hapa tuifanye hivi tusifanye ya kawaida vile watu wamezoea right. yeah so i that's more that's one thing i love about ayana mm-hmm. and you should also watch out on them they are yeah. good yeah you, anytime they drop new music now you know the link you yeah have, sure you have max number you have a producer's <laughs> number once you have his number ah hapo uko sawa yeah all right so we're looking forward to more projects from you and of course mm-hmm. that album that is coming we're going to be looking forward to that mm-hmm. king hapa naona me agree sababu ana anajeo ngoma ni kali the first song maua ama vipi distribution Cheza Africa Distribution um yeah these guys are the awesome i love them yeah oh. ningependa tu tuwape ile recognition yao okay mm. ah, nice so this Cheza and of course your friends your fam for Ayana. and Ayana. Ayana that is Tess and Makini Tess and Makini mm-hmm. shout out to the both of you the song is fire we love it and it's playing right here on Bounce Nation for the first time that is Maua bye Ayana and Watalam. I'm an Italam. Hazina. Hazina. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Hazina. Let's yeah. go.